Hi, I'm Ann Shea. Some members of the Bloomington community gathered at the Buzzkirk Chumley on Monday to commemorate the legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Shamika Neely reports. Music rings throughout the crowd as several gather to discuss the cultural impact and legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Jesse Jackson spoke to a crowd of more than 200 people, specifically bringing attention to the recent tragedy in Haiti. It's a great pain in Haiti tonight because of what we've seen happen. 100,000 Haitians got killed. We really shouldn't stop there. We say we love them today, let, let's rescue them. Jackson but, uh, says large, the nation well, must concentrate on, on various needs to get through the reconstruction democracy. time. He says Dr. King's himself. legacy of service and humanity should be continued as the nation moves to assist these individuals. They need relief, but they also need reconstruction. The issue of poverty is as big as the issue of the earthquake. Beyond the risk and relief, we must make a commitment. Because Haitians are our allies and our neighbors, and they're in our hemisphere to commit us to build economic restructure. Jackson plans to leave to support the Haiti efforts this evening, and he says he's currently working on assisting the relief efforts with nurses and doctors. Over 17,000 witnessed a thriller on Sunday. WTIU's Dave Leno recounts the Hoosiers' second Big Ten win. Verdell Jones was almost sick to his stomach. Watching Minnesota go on a 13-1 run to force overtime felt like a punch to the gut. It's like a competitive spirit in me. Just didn't want, you know, I just didn't want to lose another game like that again. I mean, we, we did that against Illinois, and I told my stomach was sick for the next two days. Jones tallied six of IU's final ten points, including one of the biggest shots of his collegiate career. He stayed fearless, and, and, he, and, and I don't know if I'd have taken him out, you know, in that situation but he stayed fearless, and that's exactly what you have to be. It's Jones' confidence that teammates like Christian Watford latch on to. Watford and his fellow big men out-rebounded the Gophers by 12. Well, Verdell leaves with, an, with more of an uh, example type guy. You know, he leaves with an example, and uh, he did a great job tonight coming through for us. Tonight, cloudy with a 20% chance of rain, lows in the lower 30s.